Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's festival season, so I wanted to film a festival look for you guys. I didn't know really where I was going to take this look, but this is the look that I came up with. So if you wanted to see how I created this look, then keep on watching. I'm starting off with NYX Blame It On Midnight Eyeshadow, and I'm going to use this as a transition color, and I'm just placing this back and forth on my crease. This is the NYX Bright Ultimate Shadow Palette and I'm taking this matte orange and I'm working from the outer corner of my eye and bringing it all the way up to the inner corner of my brow. This is a new matte color from NYX so I thought I would try it out. It's called Make Me Blush and I'm just using this to intensify the crease and applying with an angled eyeshadow brush. Next I'm going in with a Bitten Eyeshadow from Makeup Geek and I'm going to apply this to the outer and inner corner of my lower lid. Then with an angled eyeshadow brush, I'm just going to blend out the edges so they aren't any harsh lines and smoke out the look. Now I'm taking the NYX Warm Neutrals eyeshadow palette and I'm taking the darkest burgundy shade and I'm going to layer it over the outer and inner corner of my lid to intensify that color. Now I'm just taking a bright metallic orange and I'm going to pop this in the center of my lid. This one is from ColourPop, they don't make it anymore but any metallic orange will do. I'm going back in with that bright matte orange and I just wanted to add a pop of color kind of around my brows just for something dramatic and different. This is ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in the color Coconut and I absolutely love it. So I'm just smudging this under my lower lashes for a pop of color. I die for this color. This is NYX White Liquid Liner and I wanted to just add a couple shapes on my eyes just to make it a little bit more festive for festival season. So I decided to do a couple straight lines underneath my eyes, one longer one and then a shorter one right underneath and then I did the same thing on my lid. Now I'm applying a few coats of the Maybelline Colossal Big Shot Mascara and unfortunately my eye could not stop watering in this part of the video but I end up fixing it later. Now I'm just applying my favorite lashes and I'll list down below which ones I use. This is the Laura Geller Beach Matte Baked Hydrating Bronzer in the color Sunset Deep and I'm just applying this to my temples and the hollows of my cheeks to add some definition to my face. To add some definition to my cheeks, I'm taking Sculpt Powder from the TARDIS Pro Glow Highlight and Contour Palette. For a little color on my cheeks, I'm going to use the NYX Sweet Cheeks Blush Palette and I'm taking that orange and golden tone, blending them together and popping those on my cheeks. I'm going back into the TARDIS Pro Glow Highlighting and Contour Palette and I'm taking the color Fire and applying this to the highest point of my cheeks, also my temples, my nose, Cupid's bow, anywhere where I want to glow. This is the Slide On Glide On Lip Pencil from NYX in the color Sugar Glass. It's one of my favorite nudes so I'm just using this to define my lips. I wanted my lips to be a peachy nude, so I'm going to use the NYX Pin Up Pout Lipstick in the color Sophisticated. And last but not least, I'm taking the NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss in the color Tanned. Alright you guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to check out my last video and the other videos I have on my channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.